a lot of you have told me that hard is not working anymore so how would i build the contract how would i build the application i was following the tutorial but suddenly it's not working so i'll tell you the possible solution that why it's not working and how you can execute in your system and those of you having this issue this one is a very important video and as a blockchain developer when you go to write the smart contract when you go to do the testing hard is going to be one of the important tools which you will use over and over again for the unit test we have a lot of tools for building a smart contract and testing but harden is the most common one used in the industry so i'll tell you all the possible solution which you can use it to run in your computer system so here i'm on the harder documentation here you will find every single details about this particular library that how you can write the unit test how you can install how you can write the contract what are the methods are available in the latest version what are the methods we have in the old version that's all you will find here so here we have the overview it has this particular version which is the latest one and here they have all the command which you can run so if you want to clean the artifact you can run this clean you can run this compile and console which i have explained in detail in my hard course so you can simply refer to that if you want that will teach you every single thing about the hard art. so that's all you will find here about the hard art, about the project setup everything you will find here now let's talk about the most important thing and the most common question that hard art is not working in my computer and the reason why hard art is not working because hard art is not compatible with the latest node version let me show you what i mean by that here i'm on my code editor and i hope you guys have followed this particular project this one like build and deploy crypto exchange tab in this we have used hard art for connecting with the folk net and we are doing all the transaction because hard art is a very powerful tool as i told you and as a DeFi developer as a smart contract developer when i build, whenever i build any project for my client for the tutorial purpose i do the testing on the main net using the fork so i fork that network and then i do the transaction i see that what are the vulnerability we have into the function which i have written how i can improve in terms of gas consumption so that's all testing i do on the fork network because ultimately the contract is going to deploy on the main net so i have to do actual testing on the fork net then i'm going to deliver to the client so hard it plays a very important role from my point of view and you have to use it if you really want to become a blockchain developer you have to know how that so right now i have opened this particular project and let me clear my terminal and you can see right now hard hat is compatible with this particular version important if you have this particular version hard hat will work absolutely fine if you don't have it will install the hard hat but it will install as a not global file let me show you what i mean by that so if i open this one and if i type like node dash v so this particular node version is 100% compatible and you will have no issue. Same goes with the NPM. If you use NPM and if you use this particular version, you will have no issue with hard hat. It will work absolutely like Makkan. But if you use the upgraded version, if I take you back here in the node, if you use 20, which is the latest version, then it's going to create an issue. Because right now, hard hat is not compatible with the latest version of node. Soon they will do that in future but it's right now it's not compatible so what i have done this is my second main system where i do all the testing for the blockchain and i run a couple of local node so in this i have keep this particular version because i have to test the contract ultimately i have to test the contract and i cannot simply change the framework and do some other frame use some other framework to do the testing and change everything so that's why i keep this particular version as it is but in my different system i have upgraded one so what i have realized that if you have this particular version it will work absolutely fine if i show you the hard art version like this is the configuration i have for the forking and if i show you the package json file here i have the package json file so here you will find that i'm using this particular version so if you don't like to use hard art simply remove that one and you can use test network like polygon deploy there through the help of remix id and in the last video i've explained you that how you can generate the abi and you can paste and you can build the com build this particular project which is very easy and these are the basic things you have to know so again, I'm telling you that if you are using this particular version, hard hat will work absolutely fine. But if you go with the 20, then it will create an issue. So I would encourage you to come and follow this project that will teach you every single thing which you have to know to become a blockchain developer, which is very important. So this is very important, which you have to know. Again, I would encourage you to follow this and this will teach you a lot of things. So hope this will clear your doubt that how you can build the project which we have on the channel and azan is happening means it's important that you have to move around this two version 
as long as Harad is working absolutely fine. But soon they're going to upgrade and it's going to be compatible with the latest version of Node and we can use it. So when it gets updated and compatible, I'll definitely make a video on that. But if you try to install the Harad with the latest version, it's going to unzip the entire package. So here what is happening is that in this single hardware we have a lot of packages, a lot of dependencies are also come along with this particular version. But when you're going to install with the latest version is going to unzip everything. So in that way you will not have as a global object. And when you will try to deploy the script, it's going to give you that weird error many of you have shared. But now everything is working absolutely fine for all of you guys because I shared this with all of you and many of you have built this one. So make sure to download your node version this and build the project we have on the channel. So we have a lot of project. I want you to come and follow this project, which will teach you a lot of things. And these are the important projects which you have to build to get into the industry. So that's the only thing from my end. If you have any question, any doubt, let me know in the comment section. I'll definitely try to help you and give you a proper solution on that. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.